What would you say is your funniest or most memorable moment from filming? The funniest mo thing for me was that I was filming for about just over three weeks, almost four weeks, and I was in almost every scene. I meet all these other amazing characters, and the funniest thing was just having a different world-class actor drop in every two days to like film their bit with me. It was like Saoirse Ronan today, Aidan Turner today, Ellen Thomason for a couple of days. You have, you know, Chris O'Dowd. So just to, it was like just a, a conveyor belt of brilliant actors coming in and filming these parts, which was just like it was like it was like heaven. It's great. I love Chris O'Dowd's dry humour. He's very funny, for sure. So how long did the film take? It took seven years. Yeah, so from conception, um, inventing the technology to actually make this work, to delivering the movie, it was seven years. A rather long time. Two years of painting from, we filmed it two years ago, and they've been painting it two, for two years. It takes one painter uh, over five months to paint um, less than 30 seconds of the movie. At what stage did you come in? Like, did they show you a lot that had already been done? They had painted some stuff. Um, they painted uh, just some of the landscapes, and actually I think they'd got John Sessions, who's a great English actor on board, and they painted some of his stuff. And they, they then showed that to the other actors and said, come on, come on board, please, we'd love to have you. So what's the reality like of what you're actually seeing? Is it loads of green screen, or are you acting completely the same as normal, but then they paint on later? Yeah, we, so we film it like a normal movie, a bit in a studio, so a lot of green screen, and they build basic sets. They project onto a canvas every single frame of the movie, 12 frames a second, um, and they paint over in the style of Van Gogh. Um, so obviously they are interpreting the background, I mean, they're, they're, they're painting the famous landscapes or the famous places that he painted, but also they're having to make sure that the painting feels alive, so there's birds coming in and out and this stuff, so they're constantly changing the canvas, so when you see it on a big screen, you see that the paintings are alive and the tra it's, really be it's really quite hypnotic. And do you have to be more exaggerated in your movements? They said not really, they said if you can do anything just do 10% more. What are you like at painting and drawing yourself? Terrible, I'm not very good. My mother's a painter, <clears throat> my mother's an artist, my sister's an artist, professional artist, so um, they stole all of that sign of the talent, so. Well, this is like the perfect film then, yeah, to impress exactly. your family. My mum is obsessed with this movie, yeah, she loves it. They had a very rigorous audition process to be a painter. They auditions thousands and thousands and thousands of artists from around the world and there was like a three-step audition process. It's not just painting, in, and if, even if you have a great artist they need to be able to paint in his style. It wasn't easy to, to work on that film as an artist, it was hard work for sure.